Hello everybody, this is Jerry JJ Boy, Gurge Boy, or Matt, whatever floats your boat. And today I am coming at you with another exciting video of none other than the Elder Scrolls Skyrim. I kind of blanked out there because I was a little confused on what a flame matronach was doing out here. And yeah, I decided to brave it up and <clears throat> go to Sarthal, which is the second part of the uh, of the quest line from the uh, Mages College. It is really hard to talk and fight these things at the same time when I'm only holding down two buttons. It's kind of weird, but yeah, I just got this bitch. I beat her up, and now she's on my team. So it should make things a crap load easier, because as you see, I'm getting my ass handed to me by this flame or not. So as soon as we get this dude done with, we are going to go into Sarthal, and we are going to wreck shit up in the Draugrid Caverns. So yeah, he should be going down. Yeah, he's down. Down and out. Let's loot this witch. See what she got. She got nothing. We can get some uh, fire salts from this dude though. So you, hell yeah. And I'll heal up. And I already got the spell ready. And hell yeah. Let's do this shit. Now I'm only level 8 right now as you can see right here. And this cat. I swear. What a jack. But, uh, yeah, I'm only level 8, so this is going to be extremely difficult. I'm pretty sure there's a, uh, a Draugr, uh, boss at the end, so that's going to make things even harder. Uh, as I said in our earlier video, I'm not going to talk while the NPC talks, but I'll definitely say my own lines, uh, when, when it is needed. Like, when they ask me a question, and I have to answer between a, uh, preset dialogues, then, yeah, I'll just, uh, I'll say it, because your character doesn't actually talk, so... I uh, might as well. I mean, look at this dude. He has to talk sometime. But, uh, yeah, let's go on and get this quest started. We'll go on and talk to Toftir. And here we all are. Shall we step inside? Uh, damn. Stupid I have his Alembic with me, but I can't give it back to him. Alright, we're not gonna ask him about what this shit is. Actually, let's just go on and ask, what are we looking for? Anything. Anything at all that might be of interest. That's why I adore this location. We have no idea what we're going to find. And if along the way, my message about the dangers of magic should happen to sink in for a few students, <coughs> that would be a happy coincidence. A happy coincidence, indeed. Uh, I'm not going to ask him what's important about this place, because I already know. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm not ready. No. I dare say we don't have all day. Hey, well, shut the hell up. I got to eat. Yeah, I got this, uh, the mod on, where I gotta eat and drink, and I gotta sleep, and thank god, my guy's already, uh, well rested, even there, there is those, uh, there's thingamabobs, what are they called? Damn, I'm gonna look like a jack, the, uh, fuck, what is that called? The sleeping bags, yeah, the sleeping bags are up there. I'm pretty sure my dude's still thirsty. Is he? No, he's not thirsty. Yeah, I have to steal some wine from somewhere, so... Mm -hmm. uh, there's some barrels up here that I can steal from. And there's another camp up there. You know, I'll go up there first, because that place was way closer behind me. So I might as well go to the farther area. It looks a lot bigger up here anyway, so there's definitely got to be something up here I could drink. So let's see. Oh, wow, you kids suck. You don't have shit. All right, well, it looks like I'm screwed on the, the thirsty department, so I'll have to go in there and hope that we can find some uh, old-ass wine that the Draugr hasn't drank yet. So, yeah, I guess we'll just rely Wait on that. So, I'm ready. Let's wine. go. All right. So you stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious. Indeed. Safety first. Let's go. Yeah, I'm hoping that I'm at the level where they're still just playing while well, let me in this place. Where they're still Draugr. Because I know as you progress through the game, uh, well not really progress, as you level up, the monsters start to change and become more difficult. Like wolves in the northern regions change to ice wolves. And bandits can turn into uh, like banded outlaws. 
they just get really big really fast and dragons are the same way the higher you get the different names of the dragons the more powerful versions there are which is really cool with the latest dlc it uh it made it so it was harder to kill the final dragons which is really good because once you hit level 40 even if you haven't been leveling only destruction uh magics or like one-handed two-handed weapons then <clears throat> you're still a force to be reckoned with because of enchanting and the potions it's it's pretty lame because that's when you start you getting all your shit Sarthor was one of the earliest nord settlements in skyrim it was also the largest Sacked by the elves in the infamous Stupid Night of Tears, not much is known about what happened to Sarthor. Alright, I guess he's going to give the uh, lesson as we're this going. This is an exciting opportunity for us to be able to study such an early civilization. And I'm coming over here, forget his lesson. I need to get some of these juicy secrets. Alright, everything up here sucked. I was hoping for some gems, you know. Anything? Damn, just iron? Yeah, this place sucks. This well, exciting, are there any questions before we begin? Since we're already in here and I didn't ask this when we were outside, let's go ahead and ask this question. What is so important about this place? We're particularly interested in the prevalence of magical Stupid seals dog. placed on the tombs here. It's rather unlike anything we've encountered. Alright, I don't have any more questions. What do you want me to do? Ah, yes. Mm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magic. Any enchanted items will do. The usefulness of the enchantment is irrelevant. <coughs> Find any. Now let's see. All right, what let's go to this uh, dude and let's get locked Bring away and fight some Draugr. Why don't you search for warding magics? Anything designed to keep people out. Don't interact with them. Yep, he should be down here. And he'll tell me to go look for some shit, I'll find it, and then when I find some other stuff, I'll get locked up. But at least I get a really cool amulet out of it, so I mean, like, I can't complain. The amulet, I remember using for a really long time. Can't remember what it does, but I remember using it, so... I guess we'll see if my past self was right in its usefulness, or if he was dead wrong, and... It was shit. I was probably right there. Dang, there's nothing in here. Yet. I guess it makes sense. They have already been excavating this place, so why would there be anything else? Alright, let's well, get his, uh, certainly none of this will benefit my research. Alright, Tolfdeer sent me to help you. What? Ah, yes. You. I remember you. You're going to help? That's fine. Just... Stupid Just don't make a mess of my work. I've only looked through a portion of this section. You, uh, you can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. What did you need me to do? No, I'm not going to ask him that. I already know all what right to do. Then. All right. Now, I could go in here. I could grab that and get locked up. But I'm going to grab all these small ones Stupid first. Dog. Just because I can, you know. And I got all these enchanted rings that are expensive as hell. And now I can go get locked up. I'll go in and save. Alright. Now I am ready. Let's get locked up. Shit, is the is a girl in here? Hell yeah. What in the world was that racket? <clears throat> is everything alright? I'm trapped in here. How in the world did that happen? Oh, the world may never know. Now nah, I pulled the amulet off the wall. Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? Well, let's see. To escape the trap. I think I have to put it... I know it has something to do with this door. Oh yeah, I put it on. And I think I can break the door. I think that's exactly what happens. Sarthal amulet. Do you see that? Some kind of resonance. You and the wall. Wow, we're connected. It must be connected to the hunt. Stupid dog. I wonder what effect might your spells have. Alright, come on, Tolf Gear, let's fight these Draugr. Damn, this cat, get the fuck away. Sorry, cat, but I'm playing Skyrim. Well, this is highly Can't have your ship. And very he keeps jumping on my lap. 
pretty hard to kite with a cat jumping on your lap every 10 seconds. And now he's just staring at me. What a chump, Why in the this world dude. Would this be sealed off? <clears throat> what is this place? All right, let's fight these Draugr. Stupid dog. Everybody calling my dog stupid. What the heck? What did my dog ever do to you? Oh yeah, the Sigic Order. I forgot about these people. Hold, mage, and listen well. Know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, Mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. The Order. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? It said it had some... Oh shit, I messed up. I butchered that sentence. It said something about danger ahead and the Sigic Order. Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very odd. And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these ruins. And no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? Alright, let's just go on and ask what's the Sigic Order for those of you at home who don't know who they are. They were a group of mages with a history that predates the Empire. Very powerful. Very secretive. No one's seen them in well over a hundred years. They vanished, along with their sanctuary on the Isle of Arteum. I have no idea what connection they'd have to this place. Alright, I don't care about why they're contacting me. Let's kill these All right, then. Boom, come on out. What was that? Alright, they're just regular ass Draugr. Alright, that one's a restless Draugr, so I'll go in and take this dude out. The small one. While my, uh... My friends take out the bigger one. You know how it is. I go. I will take that silver ingot, though. Silver. Yeah, I'm only gonna use my basic flame spell because it doesn't cost anything, pretty much. Where's the third one at? I guess he doesn't come out. All right, now let's see what you're doing over here, then, Tolf Deer. Yeah, I'll grave rob a little. You know what? Looking at his oak flesh, really, we're well not his oak flesh. I don't even know what the hell he's using. But looking at his defensive spell reminded this me of my own defensive spell. So I should probably put it on during my next fight. And indeed, Tolf Deer. It is interesting indeed. So more fights. Did you hear I'm prepared this time. Got my alteration up. Uh, do I want to bound a sword? Nah, YOLO. Let's see, Draugr. Let's kill this bag. Yeah, it's probably gonna take me all my magic just to kill this one dude. So I'm gonna go on and switch to a uh, bound sword as well. You know, get all my stuff ranked up while I'm in here. Because I'm thinking about actually becoming the spell sword, which is really fun. I think spell swords are a bit badass. I'm not really taking a lot of damage from his attacks, so. Get the hell out of my way, Tolf Deer. I'm trying to save you. I'm trying to save you, bro. Oh, shit. That was really close. Yeah, I think I just got saved. Yeah, I think he was about to, uh... Mess me up with a... What the hell is it called? A kill cam? I think that's what it's called. Oh, gems. Hell yeah. I've seen anything like this in Nordic ruins before. Why'd you... Look at all these coffins. And I got some potion. Hell yeah. There's closer inspection. <coughs> to stay a while and examine this. You, however, should press on. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. But if it is truly dangerous, 
Tolf, dude, you are a huge jack right now. I swear to God. He's like, oh, I'm the instructor. I'm gonna stay here. You said there's danger ahead, right? Oh, well, go on ahead. What a jack. Fucking Tolf tier, dude. Alright, luckily they were uh, decimated pretty easily. The girl I picked up is doing work, so... Hopefully, I'll be able to sit in the back while she does everything. And I'll just cast some spells and look cool, you know. And when the boss comes up, I actually gotta scroll for her to make her even better, so... Yeah, I'm ready for this. Wasn't as hard as I anticipated, which is always good. So as soon as this loading screen goes away, ready to kick some Draugr ass. <clears throat> if it goes away. Any day now. Alright, there we go. And there's a lot of stuff I want to uh, look. Look at, let's look at all these urns. Because urns. I know there's a lot of gems in these. Nine times out of ten, I find, like, diamonds and shit. Well, not nine times out of ten, but, like, nine times out of ten, there's, like, something in there that's useful. Yeah, I think I may have been over-exaggerating. And I'm not even going to bother to sneak, because that dog's going to wake everything up anyway. So, I'll just have one on Bound Sword, and the other on Flames. Alright, let's kill this dude. Die, bitch. Die, bitch. Get wrecked. Should probably have it on Oak Flesh first. Wow! Damn, I just got destroyed by a flame ruin. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, this is legendary, guys. Uh, I'll have to fight that dude again, though. So... Damn, did it just freeze? Alright guys, I am back from that freeze, so let's go on and restart where we left off. This is where I was going to respawn anyway when I had died from the fire ruin, so this time I will definitely be more prepared, prepared, getting that oak flesh and that bound sword ready for this chumpity chump. Yep, I'm right here, bitch. Wake up. Alright, let's kill this asshole. Oh shit, actually... There's Draugr coming now for some reason. So I got that free damage off on this chump. Back up. Back up. You don't want any of this. Alright, hell yeah. My uh, my people are doing what I paid them to do. So, hell yeah. I can just sit in the back. Get some fire magic off. He came too close. Too close, bro. Got this fire for that dude. And I'll get one-on-one -on -one with this dude. Get wrecked. Yep, and that's pretty much how this dungeon is gonna go and I just took something really useless let me throw that back yeah I pick up the the arrows because they don't weigh anything but I don't like picking up the swords because they weigh a crap load man I ain't talking to you thank that's like obnoxiously big that sword is all right let's see stupid dog every time I hear that I think of courage the cowardly dog Stupid dog. You make me look bad. Alright, I'm gonna go on a quick save right here. Am I recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Alright, I had to make sure. And... Oh, shit. I'm just gonna keep watching out for these uh, ruins. I do not want to get fire ruined again. Who was that? Damn, that's a restless dogger. Going to pop up my oak flesh. And then I'll hide. I do not want to fight this dude. One on one. Guard me. You can't win this. Indeed, you cannot. We are too strong for you, bro. Too strong. Get owned. When I run out of stamina, I'll, uh, I'll back off. Yeah, I like that. Let her recharge. Bitch. Taking my spot. Alright, let's see if I can't get a kill on him. Oh, don't do it! Alright. Damn. I really wanted to get the, uh, the kill cam on him. 
because I got the Dance of Death mod on, and it just looks epic when you kill somebody. Which, uh, that sounds really bad. But, yeah. Got that free potion. Not gonna take the linen wraps, though. Uh, I don't think they have any value. You might be able to, uh, craft with them, but... Forget it. Aw, oh, damn. Alright, I gotta go and check that other chest, because Adept, I know I can uh, pick lock pretty easily, but I have that tower one. What is this? This is just a chest. It's a booby trap? Nope. Alright, we'll just go in and search this then. Studded and pier That's actually really good. Six uh, weight for 125 value. So yeah, I'll take that. Not taking the, soul th the skull though, because I already got the traveler skull, which is a, uh, like a unique item. It was supposed to be for a quest, but tower no i'll just unlock it yeah it was supposed to be for a quest but it was uh, never added when the game got released so yeah all right dang four weight for that much hell yeah even though i'm gonna get completely ripped off by the uh the store owners i'll gladly take that i'll probably get like uh it was 500 so yeah i'll definitely get like maybe 125 maybe 300 between that it's pretty big pretty big gap but the the people vary on what they'll buy like the dude from Winterhold and uh the guy from uh white run that's the general store owner though he'll screw you over and the dude at the college from Winterhold will screw you over they're really bad sellers to be honest oh shit All right, there's a trap there you know what I'm not sure if I have it set so my uh my peeps will set off traps. I'm not sure if dogs set off traps or not. Got that gym, but we'll see when that girl passes. Shit. Let me get that oak flesh. And then I'll get my flames ready. These are just droggers, so nothing really to be a uh, get wrecked, bro. Nothing to be scared of. Oh yeah, and I don't know if you guys have seen that before, but I got the Final Fantasy music for every time I level up. Uh, it's part of the mods that came in. Um, there, it was a huge ass mod for Final Fantasy with all the music, but the music just was like horribly done. Uh, it was like really lagged out. It was some fan made shit, and I was like, wow, I'm not having this. So I had to take out the level up sound and the new game sound and some various other sounds. I think it's like the, uh, when you go in and get a new perk, I think I got that, changed that sound too. Not sure, so don't quote me on that, but, uh, yeah. Had to make it all custom. Now let's see what I can do. Have I upgraded one-handed at all? Yeah, I think I'm gonna be a spell sword. So let's go on and get that armsman. Ah, damn, I fucked up. I should've got the, uh, the conjuration bound weapon one where my bound weapons do more damage. That would've been way better. Because I think it upgrades it from like an iron to a steel. And my uh, my followers using steel armor right now. So if I was able to use steel. I'd be messing some things up. And it looks like we got a puzzle coming up here. So time to figure this shit out. Usually the puzzles aren't that hard. So we'll just see. Alright we'll start from the beginning. Get the hell out my way. Somebody come here? Let me go check and see if somebody's here. Alright, I see. It was just the uh, posh dog, and his uh, he was taking a sleep, you know, and he was dreaming. Yeah, he usually barks like that when somebody's here. I don't know if you guys heard it, but yeah, um, these two are right. That thing in the back is what I'm lining it up to, so that's a hawk, hawk, whale, whale. Just in case if you guys were confused while I was leaving this area, it's because it was done. See, snake, snake. Stupid dog. Shut the hell up. Quit making fun of my dog. And I got a hawk, hawk. Let's see this. Whale, whale, hawk, hawk, leather. I am a genius. Alright, let's go on through this iron door. Gonna go on and save. So I don't get wrecked. Hmm. This is looking pretty familiar. I'm pretty sure there's a boss up there pretty sure stupid dog don't quote me on that
Yeah, there's a Draugr up there right now. I'll go on and save right here because I'm pretty sure I'm about to either get my ass kicked or I'm about to kick some ass. So uh, we'll see. Who is it? Yeah, it's a white. Um, I'm just going to throw up this shit. There's no way in hell I'm fighting this dude. So I'll just get my conjuring go while I'm here. Actually, I know what I can do. Where's conjuring? Because I learned a new one earlier. Oh, what do I want to do, actually? You know what? I'll get a flame nature knock. Boom. Alright, now let me get the flames. And while these dudes are fighting, I'll do the looting. Yeah, this is pretty much legendary as a mage. You don't really do shit. Because uh, you can get one hit kill straight up. Like, it is not even something to uh, debate about. You can get one hit kill. Uh, I put up a video. The first video, I get one hit kill. So, I mean, like, that should be enough for it to be like, whoa, mages, they're weak in the beginning. But they become gods at the end, so, I mean, I got nothing to complain about. Like, right now, I got, like, I spent 500 gold, and I beat this bitch up because of my healing abilities. And I already got a flame matron, I got this bitch, and I got this dog. And this white's getting messed up. So, uh, yeah, I don't have enough magic to do enough damage to this dude without it taking 10 years. So, luckily, this flame matron not unlimited amount of magic. Stays for 60 seconds. More than enough time to take out this dude. Don't have any healing for vigilance, so he's trying to screw poor Uthri. So, yeah. And I'm pretty sure my flame matron not is a little glitched out right now. Because that chump is not... What the fuck? Where'd he go? Alright, well, regardless of what happened to him, this bitch is dead. He did his job, the flame maker knock, so. Let's go in and loot this dude. Wow, that is such a bad drop. It's not even funny. Alright, let's go on to the next area. So, that was just a mini boss because. Yeah, that was actually just a mini boss, apparently. Because there's not shit in here, so. Gonna save up. Loot this urn. Probably should have did that before I saved up, but YOLO. Um, can't go over there. There's nothing over there. So yeah, let's go to the next door. Or was this the boss? Yeah, this was the boss. This has to be for your chest like this at the end. Wow, nothing in the chest. This place sucks. It's gonna break those ruins. Don't wanna get wrecked. Yeah, ruins mess you up, man. They really do. They're the bane of my existence. Alright, I take back everything I said about the uh, that being the boss. Maybe the boss is up here. <laughs> so I need a uh, snake, well, well, hawk. So let's do this. Snake. Oh, shit, it's this one. Alright, let's just go on and get this first one. So let's see, this one. That one does it all, except for that. This one does every one of them. Alright, so it has to be... What does this one do? Alright, so I gotta do this one first. And it has to be a well. Oh, it says it right above it. Duh. And well. Snake. Hawk. Well. Bingo. Yeah, the, the uh, traps in this really aren't hard to... Hard to figure out. Not the traps, but the secret shit. It's not really a secret, though. I mean, it was right over. I thought it high time I caught up with you. Oh, well, thanks for joining me after I just took out the white, you jack. The white, in case you guys don't know, is like... I've already fought the, uh, the Draugr, um, just a regular-ass Draugr. And I fought the regular, uh... What was the other Draugr called? Alright, well, it wasn't a white. It was like a, uh... Damn, what, it, what was it called? Well, regardless, it wasn't a Draugr white. Oh, shit. Yeah, this is the boss. Uh shit. Who is it? I think it's, uh... Would you look at that? Some Magnus. That is can't be there? Over here. Yeah, this is definitely the boss, dude. Let's go on and conjure up a Flame Matronach for this jump. Damn it. I'll, fall, I'll get him up here. Let's get this oak flesh on us so we don't get raped. Keep it busy. 
I'll try to drain some of its power. And I'll go on a quick save right here because uh, this is going to be a BS fight. Because we can't actually damage them until this is a. Uh, that's already done and over with. So he'll drain his power and we'll do some itty bitty damage to it. I don't really do shit. Mine's more uh, damage over time. Resisted flames. Frostbite. Resisted frostbite. Let's go back to flame. Actually, hell yeah. Flames. And then when he resisted. Dang, he got owned. This fight was way harder before it felt like. Let's read this, see what it says. Be bound here, Jerick. Murderer, betrayer. Condemned by your crimes against realm and lord. May your name and your deeds be forgotten forever, and the charm which you bear be sealed by our ward. Alright, let's take this shit, take this. Uh, that's not good until you get the other fragments. Taking that staff. Taking that poison. I was looking at these urns before we talked to, uh, Tolfdir. Or we examined that thing. <clears throat> and there really isn't a lot. Is there anything back there? I think I get teleported out of this place, actually. Now that I think about it. So, I'm gonna save right now. Let's examine this ship. Be prepared to defend yourself. What is this thing? I have no idea. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you return to the college and inform Savos Aran of this discovery? Please, hurry. Alright, let's do this. Stupid dog. Any treasures back here? Or do I just get that staff? Looks like I'm only getting the staff. Oh, wait, nah. Get a free dragon shout, which I can't even use yet because dragons can't spawn. Ice. Ice form. Ice form? What the hell? What is ice form? Shouts. Your thoom freezes. Uh, that's lame. Yeah, I already got these three. I ran up to a place with my horse, got it, and then when the, uh, the dragon priest spawned, I got the hell out of there. No way in hell I was fighting that. Dwarven. Uh, I'll get that armor. That shield is really isn't worth it. Yeah. Let's see what the staff can do. Uh, target takes. Hmm. Interesting staff. Interesting. I'm not really a staff person myself. I like to enchant my armor so I get uh, free destruction magic cost. Uh, I might actually enchant it so I get free restoration costs this time and maybe half destruction only because I don't want to get owned as a spell sword uh, spell swords really have a really hard time in this game if you spec out in light armor you don't have enough armor if you spec out in uh, cloth armor same thing with light armor you get the same armor regardless of your light or the other but I think you get better combat stats as a uh, using light armor so I mean there's that but I like the claw farmer personally because I like that regal look when uh you do the Dark Brotherhood quest and you have to get Stupid that um the Emperor's robes. And right after you get those robes, you unlock the thing in my mod where you can craft them yourself. Which is pretty cool because there's only two of those Emperor's robes in the game. And you can get these uh, other robes from a uh, Solitude from a quest. That isn't Emperor's robes, but they're like uh, royalty robes. Can't remember what they're called off the top of my head, but they look almost the same as the Emperor's robes. Emperor's robes look way really cooler. So, yeah, I'll see you guys when I get to Winterhold. So, yeah. Alright, guys, I'm in Winterhold. Uh, get the hell out of my way. Alright, we gotta warn. Not warn, we gotta tell the Archmage about our discovery. And... I think Akana has to talk to us right after we talk to the art mate, Archmage, and then we give him some sort of snappy comeback about how he's a bitch. So let's go in and do that. So Archmage, see you in his room? Yep. The Archmage quarters I don't really like, actually. 
I, I like the student room way better than the Archmage's room. Only because I don't think the uh, the ingredients in the middle respawn. So that's actually really lame. It really is. They never respawn for me. I don't know about you guys. Uh, I've only tried to live here like twice. And the Hearthstone, that update was just way too good. Is there a call Hearthstone? I don't even know. But uh, yeah, let's talk to this dude. You are relatively new here, are you not? I have noticed you, but we have not spoken. Stupid dog. No, we haven't. Then allow me to introduce myself. I am Savos Arin, Archmage of the College of Winterhold. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the College. Are we clear? Whatever, we need to talk about something cooler. <sighs> Please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough to deal with right now. Mm -hmm. We found something in Sarthal. Uh, let's do the orb one. I see. I trust that Tolfdir will provide a more specific explanation. <laughs> Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Tolfdir normally looks after your little group, yes? Indeed. Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself, I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of anything that matches your discovery. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Perhaps. Perhaps. Oh, he gave me a staff, I see. Oh, now I, now I kind of sound right. like a jack. I thought he was giving me uh, advice about the, um, about going to the Arcanium, but I see, yeah. Alright, let's go to the Arcanium. And yeah. He, oh, shit, he's already here. Alright, now tell me that the books have been stolen. Need something? Let's see. Found something in Sarthal. I know tell what me about you a bitch. want. Word travels fast around here. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything for you. Not anymore, anyway. I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. Alright, let's see who this Orthorn is. He was an apprentice here at the college. Not very skilled, but got involved with a group of mages who took a liking to him. When they left, he took off after them. Stole supplies and books from the college. I suppose as a way to ingratiate himself. Uh, doesn't anyone care that he stole things from the college? Not enough to bother with. Archmage Aaron's approach to these things is just to let them sort themselves out. Stupid Although dog. now it looks like you'll be doing the sorting. Good luck with that. Alright. Well, there's no way in hell that I'm going to be going and uh, fighting them in this video. So, I'm pretty sure this is the end of this video. Next video, we'll be going into Winterhold. Is it Winterhold? No, it's Whiterun. We'll be going into Whiterun. We'll be warning them about the dragons. Then we'll be fighting the dragon. And we'll start this uh, this dragon shit up. And after that happens, dragons will be spawning left and right. Hopefully, though, that uh, when I do these videos and I start questing, that they won't be coming at me, so I have to fight them in front of you, because those matches will take, like, 10, 20 minutes, because the dragons legend and the legendary in the beginning, you do, like, zero damage, and they do infinity damage. So it's kind of unbalanced for you, but... uh. I'm a boss. I can take them. It's just going to take a while in the battle. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. And, yeah, that's it. Goodbye.